some of them have press passes. And it's really cool, because there's like this Twitter called Jared Genius, and like they're right now, like the Ultimate Jared fan, Ultimate Jared fan, okay? Oh, I think he's always up to date. Like, we don't even know what's happening. And every single thing that we're in, they always get it. Every single thing around the world. If we can start the new watches around tomorrow, what's going yeah. on? What do you expect from Louis to say? Louis coming, because it's not just us that we represent, we represent Louis, because he's like back from the very, very beginning. So, that, so we have to do good, because Louis like, proved to everyone that we're like, really, really cool. Because like, Louis already like, has been here like loads of times, every single time. Yeah, I think it'd be cool to have Louis come and say, hey, because he always tell us how it is. He'll say, guys, go and do it. That's so funny, because like, Louis booked his hotel really, really late, and I think it's like, Seven hundred a night or something crazy, and, and Caroline like, like hotels are like thousand a night. Like, like, it's like just like six hundred or five fifty nine. All the hotels are crazy, and our mom's here, our dad's here, and everyone's like stuck in all different places. What like ultimate you guys, ask those questions. Can you guys speak English? What? <laughs> <laughs> it's crazy doing different interviews. Like they don't even know what we're saying sometimes. Yeah, like half the time we're just keep talking. Like we don't really know. I saw the Russian one. That was hilarious. The best advice that Louis has given us is that we chose to charm everyone. It should be ourselves. Yes, yeah. like, uh, just to do, do be better than everybody else. I don't know. Could I ask you to think about Saturday night at the talk show and it's going to be a performance night okay. on the big stage? Guys, is that going to be we're so excited about being in the final. Okay, we can't wait to hook up with Lena backstage because she's in the final as well. We're really excited about being in the final. It's so cool that we, we, we can't wait. We're like through to the final. It's going to be amazing. Going out on stage, being in the final, and like you getting to do the first time to go. Right? Okay, okay you're in the hair, but we're talking about being in the final. What? Yeah, we like, being in the final. The thing about it is that me and her this year, we can actually like do really, really well. Like normally, like our like, these, like, like Yeah, go ahead. Yeah. What do you expect to get votes from if you went through the final? I think I, I'd have to get like 12 points from Germany. I don't get 12 points. I don't get 12 Italy. points from all the places in the world that are, are like the biggest for pop. Germany is the biggest place in the world for pop music. So it would be amazing like, to get 12 points from like different countries. Guys, we have literally success all around the world. We want to be successful. Because like, the thing is, there's lots of people from Australia and it's viewed in Australia, it's viewed like, in all other countries. It's crazy. And like, it's so funny because like, there's this Japan magazine and they like contact and they want to feature some upcoming artists. <laughs> yeah, they want to have like two pages in Japan magazines. But it's really weird because like, the Eurovision is really, really good to be on it because. So much different people get to see like record people. And it's cool, I mean, as a real memorable, we're not just like all the other acts that like, you just kind of forget about, but we're actually like kind of real eye catching. <laughs> and the thing is, guys, I'm like, some of the, as I watched the semi final, some of them look over, like they've got so much effects going on that you're like, what's going on there? So that like, me and John are just going to keep it cool. Can I, can I repeat one question? What did you think of the first semi final? Who did you like and who did you not like? I liked, I, 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 I liked Azerbaijan. It was like um, Azerbaijan High School Musical, the girl and the guy singing together. I think the best contestant in the show was definitely Derek Mooney. Mm -hmm. He's pretty good. He's <laughs> good. And it's cool at the end of the show, he was like, bye! <laughs> Guys, okay, it's really weird because Marty Whelan's here and it's so cool seeing him because we always see him on Winning Street. And now we're here with him, we're like, whoa. Like it hit hard that Eurovision was starting with Marty Whelan and Robin Like I used to think like they used to put live from back home, but it's really cool that they're here. Like all the, Euro all the RT people are here. Larry Goldman. Yeah. It's so cool because he's like, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember being in like the first time I did the OT. Yeah, Ray Darcy, everyone's here. It's kind of crazy because like, it's like it's kind of cool that all you guys have come out and support us. You're all here like interviewing us right now. And that's never happened. I met the French guy. The French guy looks like a brother with the long hair. Yeah. What do you guys reckon of Russia? Yeah, I think he's a good looking guy. I think, I think, yeah, I think, yeah, I think, I think Russia is really, I think Russia is really, really cool. I love the glow in the dark jacket. And like, I think his performance is really, really solid. It's kind of like Greece or something. He was our favorite last night. That was cool. Yeah. You, he was among your favorites. Yeah, yeah, and Azerbaijan as well. You were saying. Yeah, yeah. and I, I also, I also really like Norway as well. I want them to do well. Mm, didn't get through though. Yeah, and like who else don't look really cool? Um, I don't know. Okay, we got the CDs. We got Portugal. Portugal. Oh, Portugal. Like, there's like protesters. I didn't know something. Cool. I didn't know what was going on. I was like, it was like, like outside the door. We're not saying bad about anybody. Okay, like, people didn't vote for them. Okay, but like, I don't know. It's kind of crazy. We got our second semi final. So. You guys want to do this, like, oh, we need to do it, like, let's do it. Is it true you guys were dissing blue? Okay. No way. We weren't dissing blue, I think it's like this it's thing. It's like a drama, drama. <laughs> like, it's a new story. But I think blue are cool, like, we went on the tour bus, they're going crazy, they're trying to, like, hit in their back. We're always cool with blue. We're always cool. They were having none of it. <laughs> if we win Eurovision, we would, like, come, like, go everywhere. We're, we're totally expanded, we're massive, and we'll, like, go 
all over the place. We've done every single talk show everywhere, and then we just do everything. Will you be playing gigs in Turkey in 20 years' time? Or in like in like five years' time, and then we'll, we'll be like in like in a year's time, we'll be, we'll be all around Europe having tour. We'll have a tour in Germany. We'll have a tour in all these different countries. We met Slovakia twins. Okay, we didn't know what was happening. Okay, we didn't we couldn't do any of our fun poses because like was like really. Actually, we killed some Slovakia twins. I had like lipstick. Yeah, it's really weird because we went to, we went to the red carpet thing and I remember the red carpet, we wanted to run up the red carpet, we weren't allowed, like little things we're not allowed to do and but, like it's, it's cool. But um, on the red carpet we went we went down and gave her flowers, we, got, we, went, we were sitting in like, the orchestra played Star Wars and Harry Potter, it was really, really cool. And then what else did we do? We stood on the stage at the end as well. Yeah. And then what else happened? It's crazy. And on our Twitter at Planet Jetter, everyone's listening, okay, you need to follow me now, Je- me now at Planet Jetter for the latest news and Jerry Genius as well because they're cool. And basically, okay, to get all the latest news from me now, because you always tweet cool tweet pics. And it's so weird because the hotel, like, you just order, like, loads of food, like, room service, but you pay for it all. Joking. I'm asking, okay, but me and John, we love, we love going to the shops and getting, like, loads of smoothies and stuff. And what about flying home with the big bride? Yeah, let's think about it. Flying home, having, having, having a huge parade, having everyone going, yes, Gemini. But it's really weird, okay, because Brack and Band and the Queens come in, so, like, some of the some of the budget for our party has to go into there, so <laughs> <laughs> our own party. Yeah. <laughs> 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 <laughs>